So you're getting the best of, of both worlds. It's very unusual for the IRS to allow you to change an election in the past. It's all based on the holding period of the property. And so there's a lot of combinations. But uh, commercial real estate, non-residential, certainly has benefited immensely from the CARES Act. I'm not sure that's showing up, certainly, in some of the, the re. Okay, the last one is an interesting article, I believe. It talks about buying stocks, trading about 10 times sales. Is that a good idea? And if there's ever been one for data mining, I believe this is the article. Uh, but let me tell you about it. Jack Vogel, PhD, he created the universe uh, consisting mostly of 10 times price to sales stocks and then compared it to the Russell 1000. Performance over one year, 16% versus Russell 1, 9.3%. Three years, 21% versus 13.5%. Five years, 16% versus 10.6%. No surprise what made it into the 10 times sales universe, mostly tech, biotech such as Visa, Netflix, Adobe. Illumina. So is it a good idea? I would say this is quintessential data mining, factor mining. Yes, growth has been outrageously fantastic and growth is normally higher multiple, higher price to sales stocks. So will it work in the future? I have no idea, but it certainly worked in the past. So uh, watch out for those factor minings. Okay, guys, that's it from the Starship Enterprise. Greg Silverman, CIOs and Bowties, out.